put some more. more like a beggar's hovel than a Margrave's townhouse. Dandelion made some interesting friends. The Kingfisher and Bobby and Bryce is a nightly performance by Priscilla the Calonetta. Guaranteed to tug every heart string. Oh, crap. <clears throat> All right. Cylinder. Bottom looks like what I found in the sewer. Silver cylinder. Bottom looks like what I found in the sewer. Got a corporate here. Absolutely excellent. Startling bouquet. 
You absolutely must try it. But afterwards, please place the bottle back where you found it. Forty-five to twelve fifty-four. Hmm. <laughs> Satisfying click. In the next room over, I think. Throw that. Stop doing that. Fuck, now I have no bombs. What a car. Extra. And Triss. Didn't expect to see you here. Certainly not with Triss. I decided we could use someone who knows a bit of magic. The runes on the bomb. I'm absolutely dying to know what they mean. You dying to know too, Triss? No, just here for the coin. Ah, Marigold playing the cynical materialist. I love it. In truth, her ideals brought Triss here. She needs gold to save her colleagues. When I recover my treasure, I'll be in a position to help her. Simple as that. Speaking of which, and pardon my Beauchelet was. Have you found out who fucking nicked my gold? Bothered Triss for nothing. No point examining the bomb. Because? Because I already know who nabbed your treasure. Commander of the Temple Guard, Caleb Menger. Your coin stands to come with a side of revenge. Geralt, would you be kind enough to tell me what you've learned? I'm terribly curious. <coughs> Henkel told me. Old man's alive and well. Faked his own death to escape his creditors. Strange. I had no idea he was in debt. He was. And Menga promised to take care of things in exchange for help with the heist. So... Geralt. How can I put this delicately? Bollocks. If you thought I'd fall for that tale you just pulled out of your ass, you don't know me one bit. All right, I lied, but only partly. Heard of beasts that are half lion, half eagle. Maidens who are half fish. But you'll never convince me there's such a thing as a half truth. I'll give it a shot anyway. 
Didn't actually see Henkel, but Menga does have your treasure. Take it you learned this by peering into a crystal ball. Maybe. Trade secret. You're hiding something. And that's one thing I can't stand. Even more than Nilfgaard. But ultimately, this is a business no, deal, not a marriage. Besides, there must be some truth in all those lies. You're too dense to make it all up on your own. Mm. Menga has been spending heaps of coin lately. Though to my knowledge, he shouldn't have a copper to his name. So, what now? From what I've heard, Menga spends his nights at the docks, witch hunter's quarters. Maybe pay him a visit, ask where he's holding my gold for me. Doubt Menga will admit anything willingly. As do I. <laughs> Lucky I hired a witcher and a sorceress who've been through so much together to get this done. What's our past got to do with it? A great deal. Lovers will jump into the abyss for one another. Suits my needs perfectly. Namely, it greatly increases your chances of getting out of the hunter's barracks alive. With my treasure. Information's out of date. We are not. Yes, I know. You parted a week after the summer to Block Muin, in the woods near where the Lixella flows <laughs> into the Pontar. But you know what they say. Old love never dies. First. First love. Now how the hell... <laughs> That's my secret, lovebirds. Really must be going. Good luck. Didn't have to disagree so strongly. Sorry. Didn't mean to hurt your feelings. Hope not. But we've strayed from our topic. Got a treasure to recover. Triss, gotta tell you something. Dijkstra's gold, it's the last thing I care about. Thought as much. This is about Siri, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Menga's got Dandelion locked up somewhere, and Dandelion saw Siri. That changes everything. Listen. Meet me at midnight by the Chapel of the Eternal Fire, east of the harbor. We'll figure out a way to get into the Hunter's Barracks together. All right. See you then. And thanks. Now the Black Guys will go after the pirates. Oh, what you can buy today. Just so we're clear, when you lose, you can't claim you don't got the coin to your blades. <laughs> A witcher? Oh, hear about the notice by chance? Not quite, but what's it about? I hear right, you're going on some voyage, need a companion. Not just some voyage, across the sea. Mark this, when I got pressed into the infantry in 1242, I promised my beloved let I'd return alive, whole, and with a pearl from Skellige. Not just any pearl either. A black one, the rarest and most precious. Well, well, ambitious. Perhaps, but they were empty words. I came from the war, that one and the next, but I never fulfilled my promise. My time to change that. Or if not now, then when? Thing is, I've grown old in the meantime, as you see. Can't manage it alone, need a strong shoulder to lean on. Which your shoulders as strong as they come. So, what do you say? <laughs> Sorry, got other things to worry about. Cancels out completely. What a dick.
Glad you're here. <clears throat> Listen, took a look at the building and it does not look good. Mean it could use a bit of paint and spackle? I mean, it's a damned fortress. High walls, guards at the gate, armed men everywhere. We could never sneak in, and fighting our way in won't work. Menga would have had plenty of time to escape. What do you suggest? Take these shackles. Put them on me. Mind explaining what this is all about? Think. Bring the hunters the vile Triss Marigold. They won't just open the gate for you. They're likely to let you present her to Menga personally. No way. Too risky. Dandelion's life's on the line. Series two. No such thing as too risky. Fine. Let's say they take the bait. What then? We go in, I put a sword to Menga's throat and ask him where Dandelion is? Might not work. Manga's scum, but you have to admit, death doesn't scare him. Always found that annoying in fanatics. So we gotta trick him into talking. Any ideas? Uh, maybe tell him you have information about the Lodge. Or about Philippa. Even better, he hates her most of all. You'll think of something. Still got a bad feeling about this. But tough. Let's go. Geralt, remember, I can take care of myself. What are you talking about? The hunters. They won't treat me like a lady, but I'll survive. Might hurt a bit, but... Siri, she's what matters. Do what you need to do, no matter what happens. Can't promise that. I'm still asking you to. All right? Mm, all right. What do you want? Here for my reward. What the hell for? For a witch. Recognize who I got? It's Triss Marigold. Marigold? Come in then. Uh, how kind of a mask is that? Well, well. Triss Marigold. Giving up drowners for sorceresses. Pays better. It's cause they do more harm. What's a drowner do? Pull the odd fisherman from his boat, but the witches? They murder kings, scheme, start wars. Don't forget turning your cow's milk sour straight out of the udder. Ah! You're done jesting, Marigold. Oh, For good. Nice sound. Put her in a cell. Not so fast. I hand her over to Menga himself, or not at all. You reckon we don't know what to do with this witch? Let go, you bastard! Vulgar tongue's got no place being in such a pretty mouth. I guess we'll have to rip it out. Try to loosen it if I were you. Might learn something interesting. For instance? For instance, where Philippa Eilhart's hiding. I'll get you for this, you- Shut your gob, ginger whore! And you spit it out! Where's Eilhart? Thought I made myself clear. I'll only talk to Menga. Menga don't talk to the likes of you. Well, then you be sure to tell him I came by. With my friend Marigold. Fine, grab her and come with me. But be sure to stay right close.
Here's where we split up. Go see Menga. Marigold will be next door. You can't have her until I get... You don't set the terms here. Dirk, you know what to do. You won't get a word out of me. Not you, not him. Oh, play it tough, eh? Just you wait. We'll take a fingernail or three. That ought to get you singing. Fine, take her. I'd rather she didn't interrupt my conversation. But hands off, don't touch her. Why? Feel sorry for the bitch. No, couldn't give a shit about her. But if I don't get what I want from Menga, I'll want to sell her to someone else. Don't want you damaging the goods. Keen nose for enterprise. You'd make a great madam. Don't you worry. Menga will give you your coin, and Merigold will get what she deserves. Do what you want. Come on, witch. Show you the wonders a pair of pliers can work. You'd be surprised. I believe I told you not to let anyone in. Unless they had information concerning Philippa Eilhart. This witcher says he's got just that. Anyone can climb that. We'll start with your pinky nail. Nah, let's go for your ring finger. This little piggy went to market. But it's not that easy to bring us Triss Merigold. Is that who I hear? Very well. I'll go see her shortly. But first, let us talk. Sit. Sit. Well, I feel bad. Have a drink, Witcher. Tell your boys to leave Triss alone first. Not a chance. The bitch must howl. I've tried to be polite. You just won't let me. Guards! In here! Damn it! I fucked it up.
I think that's all of them. That was close. What happened? I thought Menga took the bait. No, he didn't. Sensed right off it was all a front. We should search the office. Maybe we can find some documents mentioning Dandelion. I'll search his body. You search the room. I'd start with the desk. Let me see what this dude is. Just his office key in his pockets. Here. Nothing under his belt. Wait. Something sewn in the lining. What is it? The key to a vault. Here. Give it to Dijkstra with my regards. I found a letter to Menga. From someone important. A spy, I think. A spy? Take a look. Drop boxes. Secret signals. Yeah. Strong stench of spycraft here. This agent could know more about Dandelion. Bet he does. Letter explains how to signal for a meeting. No mention of where it would take place. Maybe Dijkstra can help. He knows everything. Everything? Slight exaggeration there. I'm not so sure. Key to a vault? No address? Why do I doubt this'll make Dijkstra smile? Well, might keep him from setting his thugs on us. Breaking our legs for failing to fulfill our part of the bargain. Meaning glass is half full? Of something strong, I hope. All right. Nothing left yeah, for I us here. Let's go. Be glad to. Just not by way of the main gate. my choice. Dolls. Why he has dolls all over his house, weirdo? Hmm. 
This is where we split up. But first, let's burn this shack down. Agreed. We've left too much evidence. Yeah, but I also need to blow off some steam. Listen, there's one other thing I wanted to talk about. But not here, and definitely not now. Come by later when you have a moment? I'd appreciate it. All right. We need to get Magical out of here. Power. Oh, fuck. What a loot is that? That was a cool fight session though. That was nice and proper. Winds howling. Nah. 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 You there! Mr. Roven wants a word! Impatient old bastard. What? Nothing. Be there soon. Okay. Who do I spy? Why, it's Geralt of Rivia. <sighs> will you stop following me already? I will, as soon as you tell me where my treasure is. Me and Menga didn't see eye to eye. How badly? Badly. I suppose that explains the smoke. My treasure's not in there, is it? Burning with the witch hunters. Didn't see it anywhere, and 20 tons of gold is hard to miss. You mean to say you've come to me empty-handed? First off, you came to me. Second, I do have something in my hand. The key to a vault, founded on Menge. A vault? That I need to find on my own? You've not made things much easier for me. Give me that. Damn, I wanted to find it first. Spare me. I want my reward. Geralt, do all you witches have such nerve? What do you mean? You lied to me. Again. What? You knew from the start who robbed me, but you didn't deign to share that information with me. No, I didn't. But I did deign to help you find your treasure, so stop moaning. I jest you not, Geralt. You abused my trust. I can live with that. This time, yes, you'll live. And now, time to settle things. That a threat? Quite the contrary. You helped me, Witcher. So in spite of everything, you've earned your reward. I take it you've still no idea what happened to Dandelion? None. Found someone who might know, though. A spy, I guess. Signs his name, Yammerlack. Found a letter of his. Just one problem. It only details how to arrange a meeting with him. Makes no mention of where. A ruined house in far corners. Give the signal, and he'll show up there the same day, just before midnight. Probably shouldn't ask, but... Dijkstra, how the hell do you know all this? I draw it all from the flight patterns of birds. Your sarcasm. It gets tiring, you know? I've far worse qualities than that. Believe me. And a final humble that. plea. Don't try to fool me again. Ever. No monsters to be at. Yeah. Not for sale. 
seven winters there. Shit, shit, shit. Hey. What do you want? Damn, my boy got murked. Open legs and everything. The black ones are chasing gorillas round here. This the place. Greetings, Witcher. It's nearby. Ready? Lead the way. Splendid. Come. The king of beggars, man. His name is Timboy. What do you know about him? Not much. He's easy to ire, so tread carefully. We need him far more than he needs us. <clears throat> Oi, another fight. You were to come alone, Elf. Who's this? A concerned friend. Fine. Here's how we see things. The boss at Loggerheads with Cleaver, there's got to be a payoff. We've got an offer, and it's non-negotiable. Surprise us. A steady supply of iron in exchange for 50% of your profits. Give you 25. Who are you to dictate anything to the King of Beggars? <sighs> 35's as low as we'll go. Fine. We'll take your offer. But perhaps we should... You should go home, Elf. Agreed. Pleasure doing business with you. Oh, tin boy. Too much drink. It softened your bloody mind. This here's Cleaver's territory, you prick whittler. Damn it. Who's this now? Cleaver's boys. News travel spars. What do we do? Let's end this. Alright, alright, I don't know. I feel like I'm doing way too many bad decisions. Yeah, I gotta build this shit back up. Fuck okay. that. King of beggars, man. His name is Tin Boy. What do you know about him? Not much. He's easy to ire, so tread carefully. We need him far more than he needs us. Okay, so I'm not supposed to be on this. You were side. to come alone, Elf. Who's this? A concerned friend. Fine. Here's how we see things. The boss at Loggerheads with Cleaver, there's got to be a payoff. We've got an offer, and it's non negotiable. Surprise us. A steady supply of iron in exchange for 50% of your profits. Give you 25. Who are you to dictate anything to the King of Beggars? <sighs> 35's as low as we'll go. 25's our limit. We'll throw in a discount at the shop. <laughs> You're clearly daft, Tramp. No deal. Come on, boys.
Fine. We'll take your offer. But perhaps we should... You should go home, elf. Agreed. Pleasure doing business with you. <laughs> oh, Tinoy. Too much drink. It softened your bloody mind. This here's Cleaver's territory, you prick whittler. Nope, still doing the game. Alright, I'm not gonna back down from this negotiation. King of beggars, man. His name is Tinboy. What do you know about him? Not much. He's easy to eye, so tread carefully. We need him far more than he needs us. You were to come alone, eh? A concern. Ah. Uh. Surprise. A steady supply. Give you 25. Who are you? 25's our limit. <laughs> Fine. No deal. Geralt, what are you- Wait! All right. Certainly know how to negotiate, concerned friend. Oh, 25 it is, and the discount. Agreed. Pleasure doing business with you. Oh, tin boy. Too much drink. It softened your bloody mind. This here's Cleaver's territory, you prick whittler. Damn it. Who's this now? Cleaver's boys. News travels fast. What? Lost your nerve? Poker room. Yes. Oh shit, they got more of me. Yo, they keep on. Oh god damn, I died. Follow me. I don't even know right. what alliance sure I'm following. There's a payoff at the end of this. So, supplies. That's something we can count on. Who'd you take me for? Gave you me word, didn't I? But I'd hire guards if I was you. You never know with Cleaver. Can you provide protection? A few of Cleaver's little shits escaped. Bugger probably already knows everything. I've no men to spare, can't guarantee your safety. If I was you, I'd lay low for a time. Thanks, Tin Boy. 
down the line, the bosses will make a deal. You'll be left alone. All you gotta do is stay alive till then. <laughs> what now? Here we chat, while your partner's just flown the coop. Damn it. Hey, wait. <laughs> oh, hell no. Hattori, wait. No, not pop fucking malt potion. I don't know what Wait, I'm not even doing the same freaking quest. Why would it do that? They used to hold each other somewhere. Witcher. <laughs> oh, here we are. Must be the drop yes. on the signal. Spies should show up in far corners before midnight. Just to hide and wait. Behind the door. Best place to hide. Class. 
classic. Crafting shit, I don't know what the fuck to craft. I'm not crafting this guy. Nothing of use. to uh Dijkstra, huh? None other. I couldn't resist. Really want to see this through to the end. Perfect place for a tryst with Triss. Mm-hmm. Ceilings collapsed, mold on the walls, mouse droppings in the corner. Lips almost pucker on their own. Shh. He's coming, hide. Shit right up to your nostrils. You're in deeper, I assure you. But answer our questions and we'll help you get out. The answer to each question will be the same. Sod off. That's no way to talk to a lady. To a lady, I never. But to a witch. You can. Wouldn't recommend it, though. Fuck off! I can take this! Of course you can, but I'm just getting started!
Atreus, stop. First, let him! Please. So, can I talk? Uh, depends on the question. Pure curiosity. Who do you work for? I won't say. No way. Sure about that? Yes. No matter what you do, witch, that I will never reveal. Where'd Manga hide Siki Ruven's treasure? I'm the clue. You realize one word and you howl the pain. Yeah, and yeah, I still say I don't know a thing. Does that make you think? Think he's telling the truth? Ugh, looks like it. We're looking for Dandelion. We know Manga captured him. That... That's what this is all about. A fucking minstrel! You might have said so from the start. Before your body started mucking my mind with magic. I can't believe it. For a miserable sap like that. Get to the point. The dandelion is on Temple Isle, in the dungeon beneath the shrine. Menga is planning to execute him in Oxenfurt. <laughs> Positively <laughs> spectacular. Afraid you'll have to call off the show. How can we free Dandelion? Those who leave Temple Isle do so only on Menga's orders. Issued in person. Damn it. We'll find a way. Grounded. I have an idea. Tell you later. Enough. We've learned everything we wanted to. Glad to hear it. Can I assume Glad to hear we it. can put this unfortunate incident behind us? Not so fast. Geralt. I know. He's seen too much. But why? I told you. I'll never... Either he dies, or I wipe his mind. Take his name. Strip him of his memory. What? I you. I it's not so bad, I promise. Paisley and gay. Really showed your claws today. Is that how you see it? I'd put it differently. I showed how little I differ from these bastards. I... Let's finish up and leave. I want to go home, bathe, and get drunk. Said you had an idea about freeing Dandelion. Yes. We know he's on the island, and he'll stay there until Menga orders him transferred to Oxenford, right? Mm-hmm. Problem is, Menga's dead. So... No one else knows that. He could have escaped the fire. He could reappear. Him or someone very, very similar. A Doppler? Mm-hmm. Your old friend Dudu Biberveld impersonated the halfling merchant. Dandelion claimed he seemed more real than the original. So much so, Vivaldi gave him a loan of several thousand crowns without batting an eye. Yeah, except Dudu's in hiding right now. Priscilla might know Doodoo. something, though. Fingers crossed. Listen, there's one other thing I wanted to talk about. But not here, and definitely not now. Come by later when you have a moment? I'd appreciate it. All right. We need to get out of here.
about family. Black Hoon's killed his son. I tell me what I forgot. Oh, where are you? Thought I'd mention you man. Back there at Loch Moeen. So, how do you go with this thing? Up to the left. Up one thing over. Up to the board. Sack. on Temple Isle. That's not a nice jest. No jest, sadly. But don't worry, we'll pull him out. Triss has an idea. All we gotta do is find Doodoo. So you must find Doodoo <laughs> in order to find Dandelion, with the find aim of Doodoo ultimately to find finding Dandelion. Siri. Sounds like an awful lot of searching, but I do wish you luck. Don't have a choice. I gotta meet Horson Jr. He might know something. Dandelion, how'd you meet? At a poetry tourney in Ellender. Naturally, I'd already heard much about Master Dandelion. And it proved true. At first, I thought him a bloated, narcissistic buffoon. Just at first. Well, only cows don't change their minds. I changed mine when he came to congratulate me. Never expected he could lose so graciously. Dandelion can be irritating, I shan't deny it. Yet, I also know he can be fair and noble at times. Well, I very much doubt I could bear to have him around were it not so. I see. I get it. Take care now. <clears throat> alright, alright. I'm gonna take a quick break and get into grounded. No words have done.
At least it's clean. Ish. Lurking around out here. Hello, powerless ant. Hello, powerless ant. Scrabble along, comrade. Hey, Aunt, what's the news? Oh, 
Travel along, comrade. We've got a soldier ant over here. Spotted a soldier ant. Scrabble along, comrade. Scrabble along, comrade.
Sound tastes surprisingly not terrible. Spotted a soldier ant. Let's see what we can find. Just give me a second to let my eyes adjust to that. Spotted a soldier ant. Hello, powerless ant. Hello, powerless ant. Hey, ant. What's the news? We've got a soldier ant over here. Spotted a soldier ant. This is a lot easier than that.
Spotted a soldier ant. Hello, powerless ant. Scrabble along, comrade. Scrabble along, comrade. Probably what bottled water is.
Yeah. Uh -huh. 